You see in the scriptures, believers after trusting Jesus as Savior, being baptized, and I'll tell you the route in just a minute, we see in the scriptures. And so it's believers, not babies. Now, I know with saying that, some of y'all maybe that come from a Catholic background kind of, whoa, what, what are you saying here? Because I, I understand. I, I want you to sh know I was baptized as a baby. I was baptized as a baby. And then I was baptized as a teenager once I personally received Jesus Christ as my Savior. And I was very nervous about telling my family that I was going to get baptized once I had trusted Christ as a, my Savior as a teenager. I didn't know how that that part of my family would respond. Would they be mad at me? Would they be upset? But here's what I told them, and here's what I really meant from my heart. I appreciate my heritage as I walk into my future. I appreciate my heritage. My parents were doing the best that they, they knew how to do at that time. And, and I appreciate that desire for me to, to be raised in the church, to, to know Christ, all those sort of things. And I'll give you a little history about uh, infant baptism in just a second. But I appreciate that as I walk into my future of my personal decision. Let me show you a picture um, that that is me as a baby being baptized. That's my mom right there, my dad right there, me as a little baby, Father Dubois in Crowley, Louisiana, in Acadia and Paris. We had some crawfish and some Buddha after the time we had together. I got baptized in a bowl of gumbo after a New Orleans Saints game, okay? That's where I got baptized. I mean, Cajun Catholic, all right? And so that's me as a little baby. So I appreciate my heritage. I'm thankful for my parents. I'm grateful for that. But I know scripturally, as I began to read in the scriptures here and to understand here that there was a step that I had to take because I trusted Christ at 16 years old and asked Jesus to be my savior. Wasn't my parents' faith, wasn't the church's faith. It was me realizing I need to repent of my sins. Jesus, would you forgive me? He did and he came to live in my life and he came to wash me clean and I'm forgiven in Jesus Christ. I repented for salvation. And then I'll tell you at the end of the message in a minute how it happened. But then I decided to trust Jesus in baptism as well. Not for salvation, symbolic but I wanted the world to know. I wanted my high school to know. I wanted my friends to know. I wanted my family to know that something happened in me and I still hadn't gotten over it. Hey, thanks for watching. To find out more about Houston's First, you can subscribe to our channel or you can go to houstonsfirst.org.